recording in progress. Hello, everybody. Hello, hello, guys. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, teacher. How are you? Hey, guys. I'm fine. Thank you. How Hi, are you? Guys. I'm happy. To, I'm happy to see you again. I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm really, really happy to see you guys again. Yes. Okay. I'm guessing. I'm guessing COVID didn't kill you. <laughs> you are. You are good. You're happy. All right. I missed you. <laughs> really? Oh, I missed you guys too. Uh, it's been like a month, right? Like a month with no class. Yeah. So it it is good to be to be back here, and I'm happy to see you guys again. All right, um, well, hello everybody. We're going to continue or start with the class. Let's, yeah, wait for everybody to join, okay? Lo, lo veo más delgado, profe. Mm, no. You are no. skinny. Not a bit. Yes. Nah, I'm, I'm the same, yes. the same person. <laughs> yes. <laughs> There's no there's no difference in me. I'm the same the same the same person. Yes. A Mr. René lo veo más más peloncito. <laughs> yeah, he's he's ready for the class. Me quité me quité como cuatro libras de la cabeza. Really? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's good. That's good. That's perfect. Give me a second, you guys. Hold on. Hold on. Give, me, give me a moment. Un mes tuvimos de descanso casi, ¿verdad? Yes, yeah, a month. Hi, JJ. Exactly. Hello. Hello. Oh, hello. 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 Hey, guys. Probando, uno, tres, probando. No, no. <laughs> Wait, but I'm sorry. I, I'm doing something right now, and I need to 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 see how I can fix this. Yo por un largo mes estuve esperando que me dijeran usted va a sustituir el profesor Cigarán. <laughs> that never happened, huh? <laughs> never. Oh, excuse me, a moment, people. I'm trying to find some info no problem, teacher. I cannot find here. All right, I just found it. Okay. I just found the info. No, but no, 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 it's intermediate. No, it's which is basic. Okay. This is the one. There we go. Desktop. Okay, there we go. Let me close this. The people. Excuse me, I'm doing my game. Y viene la otra vacuna, va, teacher. Hmm? No. Viene la otra vacuna, Leo. No, thank you. <laughs> la combustible. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yes. Yo le iba a decir si el profe ya se puso la tercera dosis quiere que le den más. No. no, pero esta es la del combustible. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for you. Now I'm ready. Mejor el busito. Mejor el busito. Now I'm ready. Okay. Hello everybody. It is a pleasure to see you. Hi, 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 Oscar, Wendy, JJ, René, uh, Delmi, Nelson, oh. Fatima, Ruben, and Stella. Welcome, everybody. It is good to be here again. All right. Yes. I think I see we have we have new people here. We have Stella, Ruben, and Fatima. It is a pleasure to meet you guys. Let's start. Okay. Well, let me ask Wendy. How are you? Hi, teacher. I'm fine. Then thank you for asking. Are you happy? Um, yes, I'm happy. I'm ready. 
and ready to start Perfect. the class. Excellent, yes. excellent. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Hey, JJ, hello. Hello, teacher. Hey, man, how I are fine. you? I am happy? fine, teacher. Thank you. Yes, yes. very happy. Excellent, yes, excellent. Yes. It is good to see you again. <laughs> all right, all right. Very good, very good. Mauricio, hello, Mauricio. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you, Mauricio? Uh, I uh, five five. Excellent. Okay. You? Well, I'm okay. Thank you for asking. Everything is perfect over here. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell me hello. I'm excited, but I <clears throat> but very happy to start the new model and to be with you and the others again. Excellent, excellent. Okay, you look angry. <laughs> no. Okay, okay. It's okay. It's okay. Hello, Estela. Good evening. Stella, hello. Can you hear me? Hello, teacher. Um, How are you? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet fine. you. Fine. I'm fine. Excellent. But I am driving to my house. All right, no problem, no problem, okay? Be careful, be careful. Yeah. Continue driving and be Thank careful, you. okay? Yes. Thank you, teacher. Pleasure, pleasure. Hello, Rene, good evening. How are you? Hello, teacher, I'm fine. Uh, I'm, I'm happy. All right, all for right. For this, uh, the new mode for. Okay, excellent, excited. You feel excited about this new module. All right, very good. Thank you, Rene, for, for participating. Nelson, hello, Nelson, good evening. Hello, teacher, how are you? I'm okay, I'm fine, thanks for asking. How are you? Uh, I'm fine. All right. I, um, I'm trying. Um... Okay, okay. I see that you look, you look good. You look fine. No, no, <laughs> it's <Okay>. equal. <laughs> Solo peinado. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. That's perfect. Hello, Fatima. Good evening. Um, fine. Are you? How are you? Fine. Uh, a little tired for my work. Okay, that's understandable. I mean, it is eight p.m., so I imagine that you are tired. Okay, a pleasure. My name is Mauricio. Okay. Yes. Well, I will show you my name later on. All right. I'm happy to have you in the class, okay? Thank yes. you. Very good, very good. And are, are you happy, Fatima? Yes, I am happy. Mm, yes, I'm happy. <laughs> okay. no, that's not so convincing. Yes. <laughs> all right, no, all right. I'm happy. Are you so serious? Yes, you look serious. <laughs> okay, serious. <laughs> no, okay, very good. Hello, Rene. Ruben, sorry. Ruben, hello. Good evening. Hello. Hello. Hi. How are you? Fine. Do you? I'm fine. Thank you for asking. Are you happy? Yes. Excellent. Excellent. That's awesome. A pleasure. All right. I'm happy to have you in the class. My name is Mauricio. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Excellent. Very good. Very good. Hello, Briseida. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Hi, how are you? I'm fine, teacher. And you? I'm fine. Thank you for asking. Are you happy? Yes. Are you ready for the class? Yes. Mm, yes. <laughs> okay. That's, <laughs> very, that's very convincing, huh? All right, guys. We're going to start, okay? There's nothing else to do. We're going to wait for the rest to, to join the class. All right, let's start. Well, welcome, everybody. Welcome. For me, you know, it's a pleasure to start a new module with you all. And um, I'm really, 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 really happy to see you all again. Now, uh, well, you already know, this is a course English for Work program, basic module number four. And my full name is down there. As you can see, my, my full name is there, okay? Uh, Mauricio Ernesto Cigaran Salaya, that is my name. Okay, uh -huh. that's what I'm, I am, okay? Now, 
let's go over. We're going to oh, we're going to go over some rules. Okay. I'm going to explain to you how this module is going to be and what kind of things or what kind of um, items will be taken into account in order for you to go through this module. Let's continue here. Well, this is a little bit about me, okay? Uh, well, I am, uh, I studied licenciatura in English, okay? Option enseñanza. De igual manera, técnico de lengua en español. And well, this is me, okay? Yes, I'm an English teacher. I work at Academia Europea. I work for English Corporativo. I have worked in the different schools and also I practiced in the universities. So, yes, that's me, okay? Yes. All right. Now, let's continue. As you can see, Mauricio Cigarán, that's my name. All right. And let's go over some rules or uh, requirements, okay? Let's go through some requirements. Now, as you know, as you know, Inglés Corporativo is, well, Inglés Corporativo and INSAFOR are asking you to have your full name down here, okay? Like over here on this side, you need to have your full name, okay? That's a requirement. All right? Yes, full name. So please do that, okay? Do that. Now, uh, well, it's just here. Let me read in Spanish. Nombre completo al conectarse a la plataforma. All right? The second thing that is very important, in el caso de oyentes, agregar palabra oyente luego de su nombre, okay? Now, cámara encendida durante toda la sesión. Okay, that is very, very, very important and something that INSAFOR and Inglés Corporativo are always monitoring. Okay, they are always monitoring who has the camera on and who has the camera off. Okay, so it is very essential, important, necessary, crucial, I don't know, for you to have your camera on. Okay, yes. If you have any problems with your camera or uh, your internet gets slower when you're using the camera, let me know through the chat or let me know here, all right? That you have problems with the camera, okay? Yes, just in case you, you have problems with it, all right? Yes, okay. The reason why, okay, la razón por la cual pedimos que la cámara esté encendida es porque posiblemente alguien esté dormido Okay, durante la clase y no sé cómo no está apagada la cámara, no sabemos si está dormido. Okay, entonces no se duerma. Okay, <laughs> all right, very good. Let's continue. Next, minimizar el oí el sonido uh, ambiente lo más posible. Okay, si en dado caso uh, están participando y de repente sale un sonido así al azar, ok, no sabemos, inesperado, uh, lo que pueden hacer es apagar la, el micrófono o silenciarlo por unos cuantos segundos y luego pues volver a participar, ok. Si en dado, caso, en dado caso alguien tiene el micrófono encendido, que hay mucho ruido atrás, el background noise, pues yo, yo, yo tendré que silenciar la cámara, ok, perdón, el, el micrófono, ok, just in case. All right, okay. that's one thing. Uh, luego dice participación activa. People, I need your participation all the time. Okay, como ustedes saben, me gusta que participen. So, ya saben que, que la participación siempre está activa. Ya me conocen como trabajo y saben que siempre estoy uh, haciendo que hago que todos participen. Okay. Que todos vean sus ejemplos, que participen en la clase, en todo lo que estamos haciendo. ¿Ok? Así que participación activa. ¿Ok? Muy bien. Give me a second. All right. Thank you, Rubén. Thank you for letting me know. Let's go on here. Ok. Ahora. Sigamos acá con esta parte. Dice, 
asistencia al 100% de las clases. Ok. Al 100% de las clases. Ahora. Es prácticamente un requisito que estén en todas las secciones. ¿okay? En todas las sesiones. En todas, 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 todas. Por supuesto, hay inconvenientes. Hay emergencia. Cualquier uh, cosa repentina se emerge. Entonces, en ese caso. Emerge, perdón. En ese caso, ustedes tienen que informarme a mí, informarme o uh, a una persona de administración, ¿ok? Porque seguramente, bueno, es más que seguro que el siguiente día te llamarán, ¿ok? Para preguntar la razón por la cual usted faltó a la sección anterior, ¿ok? Yes. Ya saben cómo, cómo funciona el operativo. Ellos siempre están llamando para preguntar por qué no se activó porque no estuvo conectado en la sesión de ese día. ¿Ok? That's very, very important. So, entonces, cada vez que, que no puedan estar en una clase, siempre avisen, ¿ok? Siempre avisen y siempre traten de, de conseguir como una boleta o permiso, no sé, que sea de tu trabajo o alguna reunión. Constancia. Ajá, gracias, gracias. Una constancia en la cual ustedes pues, puedan defenderse de, y, y decir por la cual, razón por la cual no estuvieron en la clase. Ok, o en la sesión. Ahora, dice, la asistencia no solamente se toma a estar presente, sino, sino también a cumplir con la clase completa. Es decir, que tiene que estar acá toda la clase, ok. Toda la clase, de principio hasta el fin, ok. Quiere decir que si, digamos, por un, un ejemplo, que Mauricio se conecta a las, a las, 8, de la, a las 8 p.m., Luego paso asistencia yo y esa desconecta. ¿Esa asistencia cuenta y no cuenta? ¿Cuenta en el sentido de que sus minutos, lo, lo que estuvo conectado, digamos, cinco o diez minutos estuvo conectado? Esos minutos sí cuentan, los minutos sí cuentan. Pero el resto de la clase no cuenta, ¿ok? Porque la clase tomó asistencia tres veces al principio, en medio y al final. ¿Ok? Very good. Ahora. Let's continue here. Excuse me. Acá dice que la asistencia se toma tres, en tres ocasiones. A las 8, a las 9 y a las 9 y 55. Ok. Dice, se tomará como válida al escuchar al participante decir presente o presente. No, present or presente. Ok. <ríe> y tener la cámara encendida. Ok. Dice, luego dice, sesiones, sesiones uno a uno disponibles. Cada participante será asignado a 10 minutos a finalizar cada clase para aclarar dudas con su facilitador. Permisos no disponibles. ¿Ok? Ahora, en ese caso, todos, todos los que están acá, al final de cada clase tendrán una oportunidad de 10 minutos para poder resolver o aclarar cualquier duda que tengan acerca de las clases. ¿Ok? Cualquier confusión de los temas que hemos visto, etcétera, etcétera, etcétera. Todos tendrán esos 10 minutos, ¿ok? Todos, todos. Por supuesto, cada uno tendrá ese, ese tiempo en un día específico, ¿ok? Yo les daré la fecha en la cual estarán cada día, cada uno de ustedes. ¿Ok? Así será. En el dado, en dado caso, no puedan estar en los 10 minutos. Ya no se puede, ya no se puede, ¿cómo, se, cómo puedo decirles? Pues prácticamente, si usted falta ese día que le tocan 10 minutos, pues los pierde. ¿Ok? Los perdería en ese caso. ¿Ok? Digamos que Mauricio le toca este día, que hace después de clase, 10 minutos, pero él no está en la clase, entonces esa oportunidad queda perdida. ¿Ok? Por esa razón dice, permiso no está permitido. ¿Ok? Así como pueden ver en esa cláusula, en la cláusula dice, permisos no disponibles. Ahora, tareas y evaluaciones Dice, es necesario obtener el 80% en promedio de tareas y evaluaciones para poder completar el curso satisfactoriamente. ¿Ok? Dice, las tareas se encuentran en la plataforma justo después de cada clase. ¿Ok? Uh, toda tarea o actividad está en la plataforma. ¿Ok? Ustedes ya saben que cada, después de cada sesión pueden ir a la plataforma y hacer la actividad de acuerdo a la clase que se ha visto, ¿ok? 
Lo recomendable es que ustedes hagan la actividad después de la clase. Por supuesto, la pueden hacer el siguiente día sin ningún problema, ¿ok? Porque a las 10 estamos cansados, tenemos sueño y queremos ir a dormir. Entonces, en ese caso se entiende y se puede hacer el siguiente día, ¿ok? Bueno, digo, lo recomendable es hacerlo después de cada clase, ya que el viernes a veces no tenemos tiempo toda la semana y se nos acumula todo ese trabajo hasta el día viernes. Entonces, es muy tedioso hacer todo a un solo día. Entonces, hagámoslo o tratemos de hacerlo cada día, ¿ok? Cada día, ya sea después de clases o el siguiente día temprano. ¿Ok? Muy bien. Vamos a ver cómo dice. Dice, todas las clases de los temas ya cubiertos tienen que estar completas antes de cada viernes a la medianoche, ya que ese registro es enviado a Insaport semanalmente. ¿Ok? La fecha límite, bueno, antes de esa parte. Entonces, el día viernes, tipo, el día viernes, todas las tareas que están en la plataforma de la primera unidad o de la primera semana tienen que estar concluidas, ¿ok? Para luego no tener ningún problema o inconveniente con Insaport, ya que ese, 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 ese dato es enviado para Insaport o a Insaport cada semana, ¿ok? Something very, very important. Y otra cuestión. Uh, cada actividad tiene un porcentaje, ¿ok? Cada actividad tiene su porcentaje. <coughs> Ese porcentaje puede, puede estar desde el 0% hasta el 100%. ¿okay? Si usted se equivoca en una o dos preguntas, ese el, el 100% baja a 90% o 80%. ¿Ok? O 70, 60 y así sucesivamente. ¿Ok? Entonces... En ese caso, si usted se equivoca en una pregunta, no hay problema. ¿okay? O en una respuesta o en algún ejercicio, no hay problema. Usted puede volver a hacerla. ¿okay? Hasta poder obtener el 100%, lo cual es recomendable. ¿okay? Entonces, ya saben, si se equivocan, no se preocupen, pueden volver a hacerlo hasta poder conseguir el 100% en la actividad o en la tarea de ese día. ¿okay? Ahora dice... La fecha límite para, para terminar el, el medio examen, examen medio, perdón, eh, midterm, es el lunes 15 de noviembre antes de la medianoche. ¿Ok? Ese midterm es el examen que se hace después de la sección o de la videoconferencia número 10 o después de la clase número 10. ¿Ok? O después de dos semanas, se hace ese examen que se llama midterm, que es un examen acerca de las dos semanas que hemos estudiado. ¿Ok? Entonces, la fecha límite para hacer ese examen es el 15 de noviembre, como está establecido acá. La fecha límite para terminar el examen final, o the final exam, es el lunes 29 de noviembre, antes de la medianoche, ¿ok? Ese día es el último día de clases para el final exam. El manual puede ser descargado de la plataforma. No se utiliza material de terceros en ninguna sesión, ¿ok? Muy bien. Ok. Preguntas hasta el momento. Questions? No questions. Teacher. Yes. Teacher. Yes. Eh, aprovechando, dice que yo este mes eh, a mí me adelantaron la operación. Mm -hmm. Yo tenía programada la operación para en diciembre. Ajá. Uh, a mí me van a operar de la rodilla izquierda, me van a poner un aparato, una prótesis uh, en la rodilla, porque la, la, la rodilla la tengo, bueno, fregada de hace bastante que tuve un accidente en moto, hace como 20 años. Uh -huh. Entonces, eh, bueno, me, adelant me adelantaron la operación, la operación la voy a tener el 29 de, de este mes, uh -huh. que es el último día de clase. Pero yo tengo, yo voy a ser ingresado en el seguro el 26, que es día viernes. Entonces, desde el viernes voy a estar guardado. El 29 me operan. No sé cómo voy a estar, cómo voy a estar para en la noche. La vez pasada me llevé el celular al seguro, la última vez que me operaron. Ahí okay. estuve. Pero Esa no, si no voy a... ¿Mm? Esa, podría, esa podría ser una solución, la solución más fácil esa de que, que usted dice que se lleva el teléfono para, el teléfono para, para el seguro. Otra solución Ajá. podría ser 
y usted hará todas las actividades de la plataforma, todas, todas las actividades, okay, para que pueda contar, ok, y tratar okay. de, de conectar sus últimos días lo más, lo más posible. Ajá, porque sería, prácticamente sería viernes 26 y lunes 29, que serían las últimas dos clases, se puede decir, que estaría ahí como incomunicado, uh -huh. pero depende cómo esté después okay. de, la, de la operación, porque si es, pasa unos, pasa unos como tres días o cuatro días dentro del seguro después de la operación. Ok, ok. Ok, no problema. Entonces, ajá. Ya acercándome los días, le voy a, le voy a recordar. Los documentos los tengo, porque ahí tengo los documentos que me dieron del seguro para, para irme y regresar. Okay. Se, los puedo, se los puedo mandar yes, por yes. foto a, a ustedes. Sí, yes, thank you. All right. Ok. Very good, very good. Ok, thank you. Now, pequeños tips de la forma de Zoom. Botón silencio o mute, camera, chat, breakout rooms, botón ask for help. Esas son las, las opciones que tenemos en Zoom. Ok. Y luego ya iniciamos con la clase. But before, before we start with the class, I ask, guys, do you have any question? No, no question? teacher. All right then. No question. Um, no teacher. Okay. No question. All I right. will have the class. All right, all right. <laughs> okay. Hello, Graciela. Welcome. I see Ruben now. Hello, hello. Hello, Sandra. Good evening. Hello. And Margarita. Hello. Hello, teacher. Okay, now I'm going to take attendance, but this is taking time. All right, let's just, I got it now. Ruben de Jesus Campos Gomez. Hi. Ruben. Hello. Hello. Okay. Carlos René Rivas López. Present teacher. Hello. Por lo presente. José Daniel, <laughs> José Daniel Meneses Bolaños. No, okay. he's not here. Francisco Nemías Colines Urquía. No, ok. Oscar Mauricio Montenegro. Presente, teacher. Hello. Nelson Domínguez Hello. Díaz Alas. Present, teacher. Juan Josué Morales Pérez. No. Roxana Elizabeth Méndez Velara. Sandra Elizabeth Díaz Torres. Hello, Mario Alexander Artea Campos. No, okay. Carlos Maria Vendaño Peña. No, okay. Reina Margarita Martinez de Castillo. Present teacher. Delmi Guadalupe Gómez Landaverde. Present. Noé Ortiz Carrillo. Okay. Graciela Janet Melara de Cruz. Graciela, hello. Can you hear me? Hola. Hi. Hi. Okay. Juan José Portillo Durán. Hello, present. Wendy Domenica García. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Fátima Gabriela Córdoba Rosales. Present, teacher. Okay. Maura Estela Orantes Fernández. Present teacher. Hello. Prise de Amilet Díaz González. Present teacher. Hello. Okay. 
All right, guys, do you have any questions before we start with the class? Anybody? No? I have a question. Not a question. No? Okay, very good. Well, let me tell, uh, let me say here, Fatima, Graciela, and Ruben, and Estela, welcome, okay? Yes, welcome to the class. For me, it is a pleasure to have you here. Okay, very good. We're going to start right now. Okay, we're going to start right now. Here we go. Do you see the, 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 the presentation? Yes. See the presentation? Yes. Yes. It's, yes. Yes. All right. yes. Very good, very good. Uh, well, Today, people, we are going to learn how to use count and non-count nouns, okay? That is the topic for today, and this is what we are going to learn, study, or practice, okay? Count and non-count nouns. As you can see there, my name is Mauricio. For the ones that don't know me, this is beginner four or module number four, class number one. Okay, yes, very good, very good. Let's start. Now, I have a question for you all. I have a question for you all. Let me start with uh, Fatima, hi. Hello, hello. Hi, teacher. Fatima, what do you like to buy when you go shopping? Uh, I like pay uh, with credit card. Mm, no, no. What, what do you like to buy? Ah, sorry. <laughs> I, li I like to, to buy the clothes. Okay, clothes. All right, all right. Very or good. food. Uh-huh, food. Okay, okay. Very good, very good. Excellent, thank you. Sandra, what about you, Sandra? Thank you, Fatima. Sandra, what do you like to buy when you go shopping? I like to I like to buy I like to I don't know if it's I like to buy uh shoes. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Mm -hmm. It's okay. It's okay. Peter? Hello? No, Peter, no. It's the, uh, the um, closet. Cloth. Cloth. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Okay. Thank you for sharing. Uh, Juan Jose, JJ, what do you like to buy when you go shopping? I like buy clothes and food. Okay, clothes and food. All right, Ruben, what about you, Ruben? What do you like to buy when you go shopping? I like to buy chills and shirt. And okay, shoes and shirts. All right. Okay, excellent, excellent. Uh, let me see here. Tell me, what about you, tell me? What do you like to buy when you go shopping? I like to buy shoes and clo clothes. Okay, shoes and clothes, all right. Uh, Graciela, hi, good evening. What do you like to buy when you go shopping? I like to buy uh, clothes and shoes too. Clothes and shoes, all right, all right. Uh, Briseida, what about you? What do you like to buy when you go shopping? Um, I like to food. I like to buy food. Mm -hmm. And dulces, creo que se dice sweets. Oh, sweets, yes. Sweet. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, that is perfect, that is perfect. Very good, very good. <clears throat> In my case, people, 
when I go when I go shopping, I like to buy sneakers, chocolate, delicious. <laughs> delicious. Uh, yes, they are delicious. Okay, everybody. There's a, <laughs> there's a question in the book. Okay, uh, today we're going to start with unit one, as you can see here in the book, unit one. You can see unit one, and this unit is going to be about purchasing and storing. Guys, what is purchasing? Okay. What is a storing? Sorry? No. Guys? What is the storing? Storing in tienda? No. Okay. In this, in this case, storing is almacenar. Okay. Al Ma more likely, more likely almacenaje. Okay. 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 Very good. Very good. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. In this, in this session or today. I will be able to describe different features about the products that my or someone else's workplace purchase. Number one, let's start. It says, ask some partners about all the products that their workplaces purchase. What are the features of it? Or what are the features of them? We're going to discuss this question right now, okay? Let me ask, what is features? Pictures. Photos. Sorry. Imagen. I cannot hear you. Imagen. Facturas. No. Characteristics. Like characteristics. Okay. Characteristics. All right. Let me ask. Um, let's start with you, Wendy. What what kind of what kind of products does your company buy or purchase? Um, I um, clothes. My the company. Workshop. My company I, buys. Yes. A workshop. Workshop. Excuse me. Workshop of cloth. Okay. Okay, let's see, uh, Nelson. Hello, Nelson. What kind of, uh, sorry, what kind of products does your company buy? Well, Nelson is not there. Okay, no problem. Rene, what okay. about you? Oh, sorry. Okay. He's there, he's there. <laughs> My company is a um, material company, material constructs. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. And what what kind of products do they buy? Um, me quedé. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, that's okay. It's not a problem. All right. Let's continue here. Uh. Let me hear Graciela. Hi. What kind of what kind of products does your company purchase or buy? Um, freezer, uh, bells, mm -hmm. elect electrodomésticos in English. Electrodomésticos. Kitchen, no kitchen appli appliances. <laughs> Okay, kitchen appliances. Mm -hmm. Appliances. Appliances. Ah, okay. Or you can say chicken supplies. Kitchen supplies. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Kitchen supplies. Okay. Kitchen supplies. Uh, in general. Okay. All right. All right. That's perfect. That's perfect. Thank you for, very much for sharing. Uh, what about you, Margarita? Hi. What kind of products does your company purchase or buy? La segunda, teacher, o la primera. The first question. Eh, 
and my work. Mm -hmm. uh, the, the boys product for medicine. Uh -huh. um, Okay, so the company buys many products for different things. Okay, I understand that, no problem. Okay, Ruben, what about you, Ruben? What about your company? What kind of products that do they buy? The financial officer. Sorry? The financial services. Okay, financial offers. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Get it, get it. All right. Thanks, thanks. Fatima, what about you? What kind of products does your company buy? My company buy the service, the room, the rental room. Okay, okay. Very good, very good. Thanks for that. Um, Stella, can you participate? Okay, no, she's driving. <laughs> All right, let's see. JJ, what about you? What kind of products does your company buy? My company buys bottom and tree as raw material. Oh, okay. Raw material, pretty much. Okay, okay, very good, very good. All right, I'm going to stop here since time is uh, moving on. And uh, we're going to continue. Thank you for you for your participation, guys. We're going to go on and we're going to learn some new vocabulary here. Vocabulary practice. Vocabulary practice. I'm going to explain to you what these words are. Okay, let's start. Number one is size. What is size, people? Size. Yes. Size. What you find here, look. You find that here on your shirt, your shoes, your pants or jeans. Okay, you find it out. Taya. Yes, yes, thank you. All right. The next one is weight. What is weight? Any ideas? Yes, so. Yes, so. Yes, so. yes, all right. Yes, that's what it is. Okay. Um, well, clothes, clothes is not heavy. Okay. All right. Next is price. Number three is price. What is price? Yes, you. Money, right? Money, money, money. What about dimensions? Dimension. Okay, okay. Very good, very good. What about battery life? Durabilidad de la batería. Yes. This is about tablets, cell phones, laptops, okay? Yes. Um, storage, number six. What is a storage? Storage. No? Storage is a Almacenar. Almacenar. Thank you very much. Yes. Almacenar. Okay. Yes. Or pretty much almacenamiento. Okay. Yes. Function. What is function, people? Function. Function. Yes. Yes. Okay. And warranty? Garantia. Okay. Very good. Very good. All right. Uh, listen, listen to me as I pronounce the words. Listen to me. Number okay. one is number one is size. 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 Right. Yes. The second one, the second one is weight. 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 Okay. Weight. Number three is price. 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 Number four is right. dimensions. Dimension. Dimensions. 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 Number five is battery. Battery life. Battery life. Ba battery. battery. No battery. Okay? No battery. Battery. Ba battery. 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 Okay. <laughs> Next, number six is storage. 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 Yes. Storage. 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 Number seven is function. Number seven function. Yes. Function. And, and the last one, the last one that we have here is warranty. Okay. Warranty. 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 Yes. 
All right. Questions? No, no question. Nothing. No question. Okay, then. Now we have some, look, have some questions for you. Number three, it says ask the questions to a partner and write down the information. Number one says, how many products does your workplace buy? Which ones are they? Two, approximately how many units do they buy of it? Three, how much money do you think they spend? Okay, guys, for this part, I am going to give you, what time is it? I don't have the time with me. I will give you around three or four minutes to answer these questions individually, of course, okay? And about you and your company, okay? Yes? Three minutes, three or four minutes to, to answer these questions, okay? If you need any help, I'm here. Did you guys finish? No, teacher. Okay, okay. Let me know when you finish, okay? Yes, teacher. Teacher, excuse me, I for I forgot. Uh, how uh, materia prima in English? Raw material. Raw material. Yes. Raw material is R A W. Raw material. Okay. Thank you, teacher. No problem. Bye. 
Did you finish now? No? Guys, are you ready? Not yet. No teaching. Okay. Okay, we're going to start right now. I'm sorry for the ones that have not finished yet, but we're going to start, okay? This time is, is, is moving on. All right, JJ, please go ahead. Thank you. Number one, mm -hmm. how, how many products does your workplace work? Mm -hmm. Which ones are they? Boy, many products, but the most representative are cotton and thread. Okay. Approximate, approximately. Approximately. How many, approximately, how many units do they buy of it? Cotton, 20,000 pounds a month, mm -hmm. and thread, 10,000 pounds a month. Okay, okay, that's a lot. <laughs> yes. Continue, continue. You don't have number three yet? No? Uh, oh, no. Okay, no problem, okay? No problem. Rene, did you finish? Yes, teacher. Okay, go ahead. Okay, how many products uh, does uh, your workplace buy? Uh, in my workplace, uh, by chairs, laptop, table, TVs, uh, only by, uh, pardon, uh, which ones are they? Uh, only by if it's necessary. Mm -hmm. Number two, uh, approx approximately. approximately. How many you units uh, do they buy of it? Mm -hmm. uh, is uh, for the laptops, uh, una for for uh, partner. Uh, one per person. Oh, okay, one for person. Mm -hmm. Number three is how much money do you think they spend? Mm -hmm. uh, I think uh, mil, como se dice? 1,000. Uh, uno, uh, I think to uh, 4,000 dollars. I think they spend, I think they spend 2,000 dollars. They spend. I think they spend Four, four thousand, right? Sorry. All right. Four thousand. Uh, okay. Ruben, 
Your turn. Go ahead, please. Thank you. Hello. Hello. <laughs> How many products does your place buy? In my workplace, is for products is uh, save money, credit, insurance, time deposit. Okay. Number two. Mm -hmm. How many units they the boy the boy of it? An um, average of uh, 10 of it. Number three, mm -hmm. how much how much money do you think they spend? Mm -hmm. I think they I think spend the one one hundred one hundred one hundred uh, by one hundred fifty thousand. 150, okay. A lot of money, a lot of money, okay. Thank you, Ruben, for yes. sharing. Well done. Yes, thank you, thank you very much for sharing. Wendy, can you share, please? Thanks. <laughs> okay, and number one, how many products does your workplace like in which one day? In my workplace, they buy a lot of raw material for clothing and cloth, threads, needles, bottom, etc. And approximately, mm -hmm. how many do they, do they buy of it? And um kind of 100 rolls of okay 100 100 of mm -hmm. uh, rolls of cloth mm -hmm. and number three how much money do you think they spend i think um, more or less um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how many, how much, excuse me. Okay. All right. That's okay. That's okay. Thank you, Wendy, for sharing. Tell me. Yes. Thank you very much. How many products does your workplace buy? Which ones are they? Um, a company buys a lot of medicine to sell them. For example, capsule rhinoflux and syrup rhinoflux. And uh, approximately how many units do they buy, buy of it? 400 to 500 units are purchased for, for months. How much money do you think they spend? Approximately 20,000 each month. Okay, 20,000 each month. All right, that's okay. A lot of money, by the way. Thank you, thank you, Demi, for sharing. Estela, can you participate? Yes, teacher. Okay, go thank ahead. You. <laughs> How many products does your workplex buy? Mm -hmm. Which one are they? In my office, we need to buy uh, some coffee, sable, mm -hmm. liquid sable, mm -hmm. pen, pencil, mm -hmm. envelopes, mm -hmm. erasers, telephone sometimes, toner. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. um, Approximately how many units do they buy of it? It's about a box of envelopes, um, two eraser, one telephone, uh, some coffee, a bottle of sabon, uh, 12 pens, 12 pencil, one toner, 
Um, how much money do you think they spend? It's about 100 uh, every month. 100? Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay, okay. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Well done, Estela. Thank you very much. Uh, Miss Cordova, hello. Hello, teacher. Hello, hello. Uh, how many products does your workplace buy? Uh, I buy three products. They mm -hmm. buy three products. Mm -hmm. Which ones are they? Um, room for one person, room for two person, and room for three person. Mm -hmm. Approximately how many units do they buy for it? I don't know, teacher, because uh, my work is the service, not mm -hmm. the product. I understand. And, I understand. And three, how much money do you think they spend? Mm -hmm. I think they spend 1000 1000 OK. OK. Very good. Very good. Uh, let me see here. All right, let's continue here. Uh, let me see. Sandra, please. Thank you. Hello, teacher. Go ahead, How Sandra. Okay. How many products does your workplace buy? And uh, which one are they? Um, in fees, garments, gloves, prints, heat transfer, uh, fabrics, etc. Approximately how many units do they buy of it? Five thousand units. Number three. How many do you think they spend? Uh, one hundred thousand dollars. Hello. Okay. Guys, okay. uh we're going to continue. We're going to stop here with this activity here. And we're going to continue with the next one, okay? It is this one, okay? Uh, let's start. I need your attention here, okay? Uh, the topic, remember, the topic was how to use count and non-count nouns. Let's start by defining what a noun is, okay? Noun, we have nouns here. What is a noun? A noun, let me just do something here, excuse me. Here we go. <clears throat> a noun can be a person, okay? An object, a place, an animal, event, fruit, etc. Okay, that is a noun. People, how do you say noun in Spanish? Sustantivo. All right, thank you very much. Examples of nouns, we have dog, cat, money, coffee, water, information, lamp, cow, rabbit, park, clinic, restaurant, pizza, sister, child, party, apple, and orange, okay? These are some examples of nouns, okay? These are some examples of nouns. Do you have any questions about these words or this vocabulary here? No? No question. Okay, very good. Now, as you can see, there's a red part here that says, what is the plural of, people, what is the plural of dog? Dog. Dogs, right? What is the plural of cat? Cats. 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 What's the plural of money? Money. No. Money. Money. Monies. Money. Money. Okay. Money. We will see this later. We will check. We will check this later. Okay. What's the plural of coffee? Coffees. Okay. We will. Mm, okay, okay. What's the plural of water? Words. Uh, information. 
No, water mm -hmm. is not count. Exactly, water. exactly. Yes, yes. Thank you, thank you. Whoever said that. Don't worry. We're going to check this, okay? I'm just I'm just asking you in a general way. All right. Okay. Yes, yes. Okay. What about information? Informations. Lamp. Uh, I don't know. What does it mean lamp? Lamp. Lamp. Lamps. What is lamp? lamp. What is lamp? Lampara. 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 <laughs> yes. Okay. Cow, cows. Rabbit, rabbits. Cow. Park, parks. Clinic, clinic. Restaurant, restaurants. Pizza, pizzas. Sisters, sisters, child, children, party, parties, apple, apples, orange, oranges. Okay. Orange. Here we have here we have some exceptions. As uh, I think I don't know who was saying this, but these four, sorry, except lamp, lamp, no. These four, money, coffee, water, and information are not plurals or they cannot be plurals okay it's it's this is okay there we go it's grammatically grammatically incorrect okay money's no coffee's no water's no uh, well different uh, context more probably informations no okay those ones don't have a plural form okay they don't have a plural form now let's continue let's continue here okay continue here like i said i need your attention here people let's go again here look there are there are two there are two types there are two types of nouns cow nouns this is versus cow nouns and non cow nouns two types two types Cow nouns, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, etc. Non count nouns, impossible. We cannot count, okay? That, that cannot be counted. It's not, it's not good. Now, remember, cow nouns, non count nouns, two different nouns, okay? Two different types. Now, look, look at this. Count nouns are nouns that have a plural form. Count nouns are nouns that have a plural form. As it says here in the picture, count nouns, things you can count. Things you can count. Carrots, trees, apples, dogs, houses, pencils, hats, potatoes, bicycles, bananas, chickens and cars we can count we can count all of this okay we can count all of this right yes yes teacher all right very good now non count nouns on the other hand look at the red the net, the black part here non count nouns are nouns that don't have a plural form, okay? They don't have a plural form, okay? They don't, okay? They don't. It's grammatically, grammatically incorrect, okay? So look, we have here, hold on. We have here biology, impossible. Biology doesn't exist, okay? That is not correct, okay? It's not correct, biology. Advice, what is advice? Aviso? Mm -mm, no. Consejo, okay? Yes, that is advice. In, Eng in Spanish is correct to say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, but in English is not correct, okay? Advices, no, okay? That is incorrect. It's just advice, okay? Then we have tea. Then we have swimming, meat, juice, mathematics, bread or love. Uh, well, actually, bread. 
okay, AIDS, rain, diabetes, dark, I think it is, darkness, help, cheese, and softball. Oh. We cannot count any of this, okay? This part, this one's here, the non-town nouns, the non-town nouns don't have a plural form, okay? They don't have a plural form, all right? Yes? Yes. Okay, very good. Get ready because there is a lot of vocabulary here. I'm going to show you a lot of words. Look, list of, um, well, this is a list of, of count nouns, okay? This noun you see here can be singular and plural, okay? Picture, pictures, bottle, bottles, farm, farms, plan, what is plan A? No, that is, ah, plane, sorry. Plane, planes, friend, friends, car, cars, shower, shower, seed, seats, et cetera, okay? All of this, this list is a list of, no, of, of count nouns. In this list, all of them can be singular and plural, okay? Yes, all of them. All of these words can be singular and plural. All right. Let's go over them to, to, to find any, uh, to find new vocabulary here. We have picture. Uh, people, stop me when there's something new, okay? Deténgame cuando tenga una nueva palabra, okay? Picture, bottle, farm, plane, friend, car, shower, seed, store, idea, shop, friend, journey, month, king, film, father, day, path, plant, candy, feel, litter, dog, egg, task, bottle, case, job, river, <clears throat> week, painting or painting, city, dream, answer, apartment, actor, year, late, job, again, no, job, month, window, child, hat, film, again, film, toilet, book, kitchen, adult, Whole page, bill, chess, town, dog, again. Well, repeat dog again. Dog, machine, cigarette, finger, box, castle, field, spot, la lake, I dress, chapter, noun, cat, finger, mirror, day, book, boy, hat again, corner, message, candle, college, problem, face, wall, candle, daughter, animal, tomato, Apartment, bird, fish, toothbrush, tape, sorry, lake, bus, and club. Okay. Teacher. Yes. Sorry. Where is mirror? Sorry. Mirror. Donde está esa mala? Mirror. Mirror. Mirror, espejo. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Guys, questions about this vocabulary? No, teacher. No questions about this vocabulary? No. Teacher. Yes, ask me. What does mean lighter? Liter. Liter, litro. Oh, liter. Yes. Okay, thank you, teacher. All right. Very good. Thanks guys. Now, as I was saying, this list can be singular and plural, okay? You can say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 20, 30, 40, 100, 200, 300, 4,000, etc. okay? Very good. Now, let's continue with the, the opposite. The opposite of this is non-count nouns. And we have our list here. List of non-count nouns. We have and we have a specific, a specific. Um, how can I say this? A specific lists. Okay, we have food and drink. Food and drink, butter, bread, sugar, pastry, fish, spaghetti, meat, poultry, coffee, milk, oil, and tea. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, wait, here we go. 
Okay, let me see what time it is, sorry. Then we have gases, air, hydrogen, nitrogen, oxygen, smoke, and steam activities, bankman, chess, homework, research, music, football, soccer, baseball, cricket, work, spending, etc. Collection of things, luggage, clothing, furniture, equipment, hardware, software, and money, etc. Abstract ideas of or abstract things, advice, anger, beauty, courage, happiness, honesty, satisfaction, warmth, chaos, luxury, peace, joy, trust, charity, energy, failure, democracy, knowledge, information, and wisdom, weather, words, rain, snow, thunder, lightning, weather, etc. Material and substances, aluminum, asphalt, cement, concrete, cotton, gold, silver, lumber, wood, and wool, okay? Guys, excuse me a moment, okay? Give me a second or give me a minute, okay? I'm back, sorry. Okay, now, hello, hello. I'm back. Guys, do you have any questions about this vocabulary? Um, what does it mean wool, teacher? Sorry? What does it mean wool? Wool, Anna. Excuse me? Lana. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. Cricket, uh, teacher. Cricket is a sport. It's a sport. Mm. Yes. Um, um, collection of things. The first word. Luggage. Oh. Equipaje. Mm -hmm. What else? Um, thunder, lightning. Uh huh. People, more questions? Weather? Weather. Clima. Weather. Clima. Clima. Mm -hmm. What else? Esta es la primera que está en activities, que es el Pacamon. It's a sport. Bangamon is a sport. The, it's knowledge and... Knowledge. Conocimiento. Thank you, teacher. A teacher. Um, steam. steam. Vapor. Steaming. Vapor. Thank you, teacher. Yes. Uh, for for nature. Sorry. For nature. Uh huh. Where is it? For what? nature. Yeah. A failure. A collection of things for nature. Collection of things. Furniture. 
furniture. Yes, mueble. Mueble. Poultry. 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 It's poultry. It's, it's, it's some uh, kind of food. It's like postre. No, no. It's uh, ducks, chickens, like uh, ave domesticas. Oh. It's, Teacher, an um, abstract mm -hmm. and worms. Worms? Warm, cali uh, calidez. Calidez. Yes. Okay. And wisdom. 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 Sabiduría. Sí. Sabiduría, wisdom. Wisdom. Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank What you, else? teacher. Okay, now let me tell you guys for this vocabulary that you see here. Yes, sorry. L lumber? Lumber. Material. Yes. Materials and substance. Substances. Substances. Yes. Madera. It's wood. Lumber. Wood. Lum lumber is, is uh, lumber and wood, madera. Um, thank you, teacher. Thank you so much, teacher. All right. Guys, this list that you see here, food, drinks, activities, abstract, weather, words, all of them, they are never plural, okay? They, they cannot be plural, all right? So be very careful with it. Be careful. Be careful with it. So we, we cannot make them plural, okay? We cannot make them plural. It's grammatically, grammatically incorrect, all right? Let's continue here. Now, this is in the book, okay? It says how to use countable and uncountable nouns, or how to use countable and uncountable nouns. How much and how many? How do you say how much in Spanish, people? Cuánto de cuánto cantidad. Hay. No, no. How much is this? Cuánto. cuánto. Well, actually, it depends. It depends on the word, on the noun. Cuánto or cuánta. Okay. Yes. Now, we have examples here. How much does the refrigerator weigh? Wait, no wait, wait. Okay. Wait. How much does it cost? How much <clears throat> is the warranty? And how much? Oh, sorry. How much does it store? Storage. Store. Storage. Storage. Okay. Then we have how many? How many features does it have? How many colors is in it? Hold on. How many functions? Functions does it? Sorry to 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 say this, but. I'm going to fix this. Guys, here is a store, not storage, okay? Hold on, give me a second. That is not correct. How much does it store, not storage? And here the S, and the T don't go, it's just wait. This is pesar, pesar. Okay. Yeah. How many features does it have? How many colors is this in? Does it have for C1? All right. There you go. Okay, it has some, some mistakes there, but that's okay. Now, as you can see, guys, 
we have how much here and how many, okay? Now, how do we use how much? How would we use how many? Well, let me tell you, how much is used with non-count nouns or uncountable nouns, as it says here, and how many is used with count nouns or plural things, okay, which we will see right now. Let me just, um, here we go. Okay, how many and how much plus nouns? How many and how much plus nouns? Okay, look at this information, very important. It says, the choice between much and many depends on the noun it is describing. Much is used to describe mass nouns or non-count nouns, like use, rise, patience, and happiness. Mm -hmm. Many is used to describe count nouns or nouns that can be counted like books, ideas, leaves, and shoes. When, sorry, I didn't read this part uh, up here. When using many, the noun will always be plural. Over here, when using much, the noun will always be singular. It cannot be plural. That's what I mentioned before. All right, very good. Now, can you make your own how many and how much questions? Let me just stop this here. Oh, do you have any questions, people? Any questions? No? Okay. Teacher. Yes. Hello. Hello. Okay. Um, how, how many is mm -hmm. for uh, no con, no con, how, how many, no contables. how many is for count nouns, para contables, okay. how much, no contables, what? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Now, I'm going to ask you some questions. Well, actually, let's let's ask each other, okay? Let's start here. How many and how much, okay? We're going to be asking those questions. Let's start. Let's see. Rene, Ren, Rene, sorry, Rene. <laughs> sorry. Rene and Fatima, please. Teacher? Fatima, ask Rene a how many or a how much question. Uh, okay. Rene, how many books do you do you have? Uh, I have I have uh five books. Okay, five books. In my, now you, in my house. Okay. Now you, Rene, ask Fatima. Okay. Uh, Fatima, uh, how many uh, shoes uh, have uh, in your room? How many I... shoes? Wait. How many shoes do you have? Do you have? Okay. You how do. many do you have no, how many shoes in the room how I many have... shoes in the room wait wait how many shoes do you have in your room in the room Thank you a lot teacher yes repeat how many <laughs> shoes fatima how many shoes uh, do you have? Do you have in your room? There you go. I have 10 shoes in my room. Excellent. Thank you very much, Renee and Fatima. Let's listen to Graciela and Guadalupe. Tell me. Hello. Graciela. Yes. 
Graciela, how many cups of coffee uh, you drink Do you this drink? day? Oh, wait, did you? What day? Did you drink this day? Okay. I I drink uh, coffee. I drank. Only one. Uh, I, I, I drank. I drank. Uh -huh. I drank uh, coffee. Okay. One. Only one. In the one, morning. One cup. One coffee. One ah uh, one cup of coffee. Uh -huh. In the morning. All right. Thank you. Now Graciela, ask um, for a new plan. Uh, how many? Um, how many? Um, how many skirts do you have? Skirt. Uh, uh, blouse. Blouses. Skirts. Faldas. Uh huh. I have two. Two. Como dijo? Skirts. 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 Ah, I have two skirts. Okay. Okay. Thank okay. you. Thank you, Delmi, and thank you, Graciela, for your participation. Let's listen to Nelson and Estela. Hello. Hello. Go ahead, please. How many found you have? How many phones? Phones. Do you? Do you have? Do, do you have? Phones? Money? How many? Cell. Cell phones. Phones? Ah, cell phones. I have two cell phones. Okay. Okay, very good, very good. Now, you, Estela, ask Nelson. Nelson, how many brothers do you have? No, <laughs> nothing. <laughs> I have no brothers. No brothers. Repeat, no I family. Have, I have, okay. <laughs> I have no brothers. I am no, no family. <laughs> I don't have a family. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Nelson. Sorry, Nelson. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's, continue. let's continue here and let's listen to Wendy and Ruben. Wendy, Hello. how many shirts you seen one day? Excuse me, repeat me, please. How many shirts you seen in one day? Um, only one. Okay, I use only one shirt. Yes. No, repeat, I use only one shirt. Shirt. Yes, shirts. Yes, I I use only one. Okay, okay. Now you, Wendy, ask Ruben. And how much patience do you have? Okay, no patience. <laughs> no patience. <laughs> okay. Excuse me. <laughs> Ruben? And not understand. How much how much patience do you have, she said? I not patient. Hmm? Paciencia. Patience. I not Pati patient. Oh really? Oh no. <laughs> okay, okay. Thanks. Thanks for sharing. Let's continue. Let's listen to Sandra and Oscar. Okay. Okay. Hello, Oscar. How many books um, do you need? Do you need? Do you need? Why? Come <laughs> How many books um, do you need? 
have you or do you? Do you? How many books do you need? Read. Ah, read. Okay. Eh, voy a repetir la pregunta. No. How many books do you read? Bueno, no sé, le escuché bien, perdí como cuántos libros tengo o cómo. No, how, no many books, how many books do you read? How many books do you read? Read? Books read? Books read? Eh, ¿Qué es read, teacher? Read, leer. Leer. Uh, a few, uh, three, three books. Okay, three books. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Let's continue, please. Uh, Margarita and JJ, please. Okay, Margarita, how much money you spend in the week? Do you spend? How much money do you spend in the week? Okay. In the week, the chance. The how, much, how much money do you spend in a week? A la semana. Um, how many is fine? I spend. I spend. Mm -hmm. I am fine. No, I spend. How much money? Cuánto, cuánto dinero? How much money? I I spend I six six dollars six dollars okay impossible <laughs> six dollars in, in one day okay in one day six dollars but in a week that's not possible <laughs> all right okay. Let me see. Uh, ahora me to Sorry. Yes, yes. Now I ask you, Mar Margarita, ask uh, Juan Jose. Okay. Um, Juan Jose, hola. How many children do you have? I have two children. Okay. I have okay. two children. All right. Noe, hello. Hello, teacher. Alexander, hello. Are you there? Hi, coach. Hi. Good evening. Good evening, guys. Okay, Noé and Alexander, please. Okay. Mi pregunta. How much sugar do you put in your coffee? Okay. Is... <laughs> Is... How much... How much sugar uh, is sugar do you put in your coffee? I I not beer coffee. No, oh, okay. I don't drink. I don't I, drink I, coffee. I don't drink, perdón. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, uh, so you Alex I, ask Noe, please. How many cars do you have? No, I don't. I don't know. I don't have car. Okay, sorry. I, Thank you. Okay. I'm sorry to hear that. All right. Very good, guys. Thank you for your participation here. We are going to continue with the next part, and the next part is this. Let me show you. I'm going to project it in the book here. It is not this book. Sorry. Excuse me, it was not that cool.
Wait, the book is loading. <laughs> All right, it is ready now. Man, Let me... mañana. No. Quiere salir. Creo que lo ya tiene con vos. Ay, Dios. Mira, niño quiere ir. <laughs> we don't need to know that excuse if me, excuse me teacher excuse me no problem okay it's okay now we're going to continue guys here okay in this part it's part five it says complete the following questions using how much or how many okay i'm going to give you a couple of minutes to finish this okay yes Remember count nouns and non count nouns. So let's work on this, okay? I will give you like three or four minutes to finish. Then we start reading. Teacher. Yes. Y el, el folleto lo pueden mandar a, a, al WhatsApp. Yes. Por favor. Ok, no problem. Ajá. Para poderlo imprimir. Ok, I will. Ok. Did you guys finish?
Yes. Okay, thank you. All right. Uh, thank you. We're going to start sharing right now. Okay, let me see. <laughs> Stella, can you read number one? Stella, hello. Are you sleeping? <laughs> Okay, she's just sleeping. All right, JJ, can you read number one? Number one. How many pieces? Pieces. Pieces do I need to assemble these? Assemble. Okay, how many or how much, people? How many? How many? Okay. How many? How many? How much? It, it is how many? How much? No, because pieces is plural. Okay. So it is how many pieces? Okay. Yes. So I need to assemble. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Let's continue. Here. Yes, Graciela. Read number two. How many pieces do I need to assemble this? To assemble this? The second one. Question number two. Mm -hmm. Okay, second. Um, uh, how much? How much do these books book, books cost? Okay. How much do these books cost? Okay, thank you. Yes. People, do you agree? Is it how much or how many? How many? How much? Many. How many? It's it's how, how many? many? It is how much? It's about the price. Yeah. How much? It's how many? Cost. The price. How much? Mm. How much? Yes. Okay. Number three, oh. Fatima. Uh, how much is the battery life? of this computer. Okay, how much is the battery life of this computer? Yes, okay, it is how much, okay? Next, number four, let me see here. Rene, number four. How many hours uh, do I charge it? How many hours do I charge it? Okay. Hours is plural, so it's how many. Okay. Yes. Uh, let's see. Nelson, read. Uh, Five, how much money do you have? Okay. How much money do you have? I have zero dollars. Okay. I have, I have no money. Okay. <laughs> But I receive bitcoins if you want to donate. Bitcoin. All right, let's continue here. Let's see. Reina, can you read number six? <clears throat> How many gallons of water okay. does he need? Does? Does this need? Does this need? Okay, yes. How many gallons of water does this need? Yes, how many gallons? All right. Thank you for that. And thank you everybody for sharing and for participating. You have done a very good job. Now, before, before we continue, I would like to show you this list. Yes, okay. You see the Can you guys see the list? Hello, can you see the list? 
Okay. Then uh, read, uh, read the information, read the information. Well, today's session is going to be for Ruben de Jesus Campos Gomez. And then tomorrow, well, tomorrow we don't have a class. There's no class tomorrow. So I will see Rene, Carlos Rene on Wednesday. Then Jose Daniel, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. All right. Yes. Take note, people. Take notes. Take notes here on this. Okay. Let me just make it like this. All right. Look, you can take a picture right now or, and, or, or a screenshot and you can share this info to the group because this is very important information. Okay. If you can, if it is possible. All right. Thanks. Now, I have another question. Are you all are you all in the group in the WhatsApp group? Hello. No. John, I, I need. Remember, the link to join the WhatsApp group is in the email. You have all of you have received an email from Inglés Comparativo, and in that you will see the link which will take you to the WhatsApp group directly, okay? So you can join the group through that uh, link or using that link, okay? Yes? Yes, sir. All right. Let me, let me take attendance, okay, here. Uh, mm -hmm. Ruben de Jesus Campos Gomez, hi. Presente. Okay. Carlos René Robert, uh, Rivas López, sorry. Present. Jose Daniel Meneses Bolaños. No, he was not here today. Francisco Neemías Godínez Urquía. No. Oscar Mauricio Montenegro. Present. Presente. Nelson Domínguez Díaz Alas. <coughs> Present. Oh, no, COVID. Juan José, Juan José Morales Pérez. <clears throat> is not here. Roxana Elizabeth Me Mendez Melara. She was not here either. Sandra Elizabeth Díaz Torres. Here, teacher. Hello. Hello. Mario Alexander Artea Campos. Here. Hello. Hello. Carlos Maria Medaño Peña. Was not here. Reina Margarita Martinez de Castillo. Present teacher. Okay. Delmi Guadalupe Gomez Landa Verde. Present. All right, all right, thank you. Nelson, sorry, Nelson. Noé Ortiz Carrillo. Present teacher. Hello. Graciela Janet Melara de Cruz. I'm here. Hello. Juan Jose Portillo Durán. Hello, present. Wendy Domenica Garcia. I'm here, teacher. Fátima Gabriela Córdoba Rosales. Present, teacher. Maura Estela Orantes Fernández. Present, teacher. Brisena Yamilet Díaz González. Indigena left class a long time ago. <laughs> I don't know what happened to her. I don't see Wendy here either. Okay. Guys, do you have any questions? <clears throat> Guys, questions? Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. Lo siento, en español se lo voy a decir. Okay. Todavía como que muy claro. Sé que este tema ya lo hemos visto, pero creo que se me ha dorado porque um, me confundí siempre en cuándo vamos a utilizar how much y how many. Oh, ok. ¿Me puede dar otro ejemplo? Yes, no problem. Ok, un ejemplo puede ser how much coffee do you drink? ¿Cuánto café tomas? How many, how many students do you have? ¿Cuántos estudiantes tienes? How many, plural, how much, singular. O más específico, how many uh, 
uh, nombres contables, how much nombres no contables. How much no contables. Uh -huh. Singular. Yes, yes, siempre, always. <laughs> Y how many plural. Exactly. Yes. Okay. okay thank you. Mm -hmm. More questions, people? Eh, teacher, solo más fácil. How much, cuánto, cuánta. How many, cuántas, cuántos. Exactly. Yes. Thank you. Uh, okay. Yes. That's what it is. All right. Thank you. More, more questions? Teacher. Hello. Excuse me. Eh, se me apagó el teléfono. Por eso me salí, digamos. Porque okay. se me apagó el teléfono. Ok. Thank you. And now, sorry. Ok. No problem. It's ok. It's ok. That's what I thought. Mm -hmm. All right. Guys, <laughs> it's just relax, Alex. <clears throat> okay, people, are you happy that tomorrow you're not going to work? Any any plans for tomorrow? <laughs> no plans. I, 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 I rest, teacher. I rest. Dice Alex que él va a tener clases mañana, dice, porque no estuvo hoy. Oh, okay. No problem. <laughs> he can join the class tomorrow with no problems, okay? Yes. Question TV. Sleep of night. <laughs> Clases privadas con Dominic. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> through, through WhatsApp. You can use WhatsApp and you can join the WhatsApp group. <laughs> All right. Guys, remember, join the group, the WhatsApp group today or tomorrow, whenever you can. And also remember to work on the platform. You can do that either today or tomorrow because tomorrow you will have a day off so you can work on the on the on the platform tomorrow okay with no problems or even you can work on the platform the next day which is on wednesday okay you can do that as well now guys if there are no questions i just would like to thank you guys for joining the class today for taking the class into consideration and i will see you on wednesday i wish you the best for tomorrow have a great day tomorrow rest sleep Drink water and soda. Okay. <laughs> yes. Okay. And uh, bueno, re teacher, recuerde que mañana es día de beer. nosotros, de los hombres. And beer. Día de todos los santos. De los finados. Ay, sí. No, de los santos. He's dangerous. <laughs> He's dreaming. Okay. <laughs> yes. Yes, of course. <laughs> All right. <laughs> the Angels Day. Okay, Angels Day. Angels Day. All right. Well, thank you, uh, guys. Thank you, everybody. Uh, and Graciela, Estela, Ruben, and Fatima. A pleasure to meet you guys. And I'm happy to have you here in the class. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet thank you. Thank you, Tisha. Ruben. Nice to meet you, too. Ruben, hello Ruben. You stay. Hello. You stay, and the rest, you can go sleep. Okay. People, see you on Wednesday. Bye bye. 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 Good night, sweet dreams. I see I you. See you. I see you after tomorrow. Bye bye. All right. See you guys. Bye bye. Good night. Hello. Te voy a quitar un segundo al compañero. Ok, ok. Tonta o boba. Siempre que usted nos saluda, nos dice um, guys. Yes. ¿Qué significa eso? Chicos. 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 Yes. <laughs> ¿Cómo se escribe eso? Um, in the chat. In the chat. Uy. Ok. Thank you. Bye.
Bye, guys. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Bye, Sandra. Bye, Sandra. Bye. Okay. Ruben, you are a Yeah. <laughs> No, brother. Oh. <laughs> we we cannot be friends. Uh, fear for, fear for yes, exactly, exactly. Yes. <laughs> okay, man. Do you have any questions? Fear for fear. <laughs> any questions, man? Eh, yo tengo solo una consulta más o menos ahí cuando se usan no. Los, los, no sé si son pronombres este it and and do do no it uh -huh. sí es que en esas cosas me, siempre me da duda cuando se usan el que está en el chat el que acabo sí, de sí sí it no, it es un pronombre para objetos Use for objects and animals. It's for object and animals. It's para objetos y animales. Sí, pero en ocasiones cuando se hacen conjugaciones de preguntas también no suelen poner, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. O se refiere a un objeto o a un animal. Mm -hmm. Siempre. Por ejemplo, does it like to eat? Does it like to eat? Le gusta comer. Ese it se refiere a un animal. Yes. Se a a ver, un... Pero, ahí, pero ahí no dice me gusta comer un animal. <risas> Ajá, la cuestión en este caso sería que ya, ya tienen una, una conversación previa y es a la que se refiere it. Se refiere a un animal, ¿ok? Sí. Yo like siempre lo relacionaba como eso. O sea, ¿te gusta comer eso o algo así? Ajá, ese caso sería objeto. Do you like to eat it? Do you like to eat that? Be different. Cierto. Esa pregunta es usted, la que está ahí en el chat. Dice, do you like to eat? ¿Eh? To eat it. Sí. En ese caso, it se refiere a un objeto, okay, a un objeto, pero ya que ha sido mencionado anteriormente, por supuesto, en una conversación. Ok. Yes. En este caso, actualmente, yo estuve en clases de, siempre con inglés corporativo, pero los módulos que solo duraban una hora. Ah, okay. Entonces, eh, estos no son... este digamos, correlativos a eso, ¿verdad que no? No. Porque ya me quedé en going to y aquí ya vamos, ya está, es otro tema. Sí, es otra, otra, otra cuestión, sí. Sí, es, es muy diferente. A sí, entonces, sí, entonces me, este, ya cuando veo acá el correlativo ya un poco distorsionado con lo que estuve viendo. Sí. Sorry, man. Sí, entonces yo me quedé ahí. Eh, porque ahí, ahí nos quedamos en Going To con ella y ya, ya nos siguieron. Me escribí por este otro lado, por, por medio de esa for, entonces ya. Pero ya aquí ya estaba viendo que estaba un poquito más avanzado, ¿van, verdad? Sí, ese es el cuarto mes de ellos. El cuarto. El cuar cuarto, sí, porque... cuarto mes. Sí, pero allá igual decían módulos pero, por ejemplo, de inglés principiante, cuatro iba a iniciar, creo. ¿eh? Uh -huh. pero, aquí sí está, pero aquí sí va un poquito más adelantado, pero igual les entiendo un poco. Sí, sí veo que, que no le cuesta mucho. Entiende un poco. Sí, por ejemplo, esto es de... de Hot much y hot many ya lo había visto, pero relacionado, eh, no así con las palabras que 
los con eh, no con op, sino solo para cuando es cuánto y, y cuánto, ¿verdad? Ahí sí. lo había visto. Uh -huh. I understand, entiendo, sí, sí. Sí, es que más, ahí, más, sí. un poco más específico, ¿eh? con los, con los Sí, aquí ya va un poquito más específico utilizando ya los este, nombres específicos, me imagino. Uh -huh. yes. okay. No, pero ahí tú las solo eso tenía ahí. Tú ¿no? de las cosas la, anteriores, algún tema de lo, de lo que vio anteriormente. No, de esas no. Como ya, como les digo, aquí ya van un poquito más adelantado. Entonces, uh -huh. ahí ahorita estoy tratando de, de arrastrar lo que hay para implantar esto. Ok. Ya está en el grupo usted de WhatsApp. Ahorita no. Uh, bueno, en el correo está, está en el enlace, el, el, el link que lo va a dirigir hacia, hacia el grupo. O automáticamente el link lo une, a, lo, lo une al grupo de WhatsApp. Lo enviaron a los correos, entonces. Sí, ese, sí. Porque lo estaba buscando y no, no me aparece. Y ahí, en, ahí, a todos les ha mandado ese correo, a todos los tiene que tener ahí en el correo. No se puede mandar acá, reenviar acá. Solo me tiraron el para acceder al material. No, oh, ok. Acá se lo voy a compartir, entonces aquí tiene que estar el link. Aquí tiene que estar el link. Permítame un segundo que está cargando el correo. Que tiene acceso a la, a la plataforma, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok. Porque ahí van a dar continuidad. Porque como llamo Bueno, tenía acceso, pero en los módulos anteriores, como le digo, de las que solo duraban una hora. En este caso será... No sé si ahí mismo se va a continuar. No, no. Ahí usted entra a su, a su, a su, si tiene nada su correo, entra en la plataforma con su, con su usuario, contraseña y, y ahí le aparecerá automáticamente, ya el, el sistema lo, lo, lo reconoce que está en este, en este curso del módulo 4, ahí le aparecerá en inglés principal de 4, ahí tiene que aparecer el módulo 4. Y si no le aparece, pues contáctenme a mí para que yo informara a, a, no aparece. No veo toda la información. Pero si le quito, aquí está. Está el grupo. Acá está. Déjame se lo comparto. Copiar y acción de enlace. Aquí está. Ok. Cualquier cosa en la plataforma, usted me avisa a mí o, o ponen en el grupo ahí de WhatsApp. Acá le acabo de dar el link aquí por, 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 por Zoom. Ahorita sí ya me, ya me uní. Sí, ya, ya se puede unir. Sí, ya, como aquí lo, aquí lo, lo mandó al chat ahorita. Ah, ok, ok, muy bien, entonces. Sí, ahorita me uní. Ajá. Trate de ver si, si ya aparece en la plataforma, si ve que no aparece ninguna de, de principiante 4, informe en el grupo o escríbame a mí o a cualquier persona que esté encargada de, de administración para que puedan resolver ese problema. Ya que anteriormente se, ha dado, se dio un asunto con, con dos personas específicas estas personas estuvieron dos semanas, casi tres semanas, sin hacer ninguna actividad. Y luego ya al final de, 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 de las tres semanas, tenían todo acumulado y estaban bien atrasados en ellos y les costó mucho hacer ese, ese problema. Entonces, hay como recomendación para que no le afecte más adelante. En ese caso. Sí, claro. Okay. Creo que eso sería todo en el caso. Ok. Ya sabes, las clases están, ahí, están en YouTube, por cualquier cosa, si se si, si, falta, una, falta una sesión. Ahí están las clases. Igual en la plataforma aparecen la, la, los videos de conferencia. Ahí está todo. Okay. El manual ahí está, ¿verdad? Ya está. Sí, también, este manual. Uh -huh. Igual siempre lo mandan, lo, lo envían, lo reenvían al grupo. Okay. Siempre hay uno que lo reenvía, dos que lo reenvían al grupo. Ahí está siempre el manual también. Okay. Perfecto. Ya lo voy a descargar entonces. Ok, perfecto.
Y cualquier duda que tenga en la clase, siempre pregúntenme, ¿ok? No se queden con esa duda, ¿ok? Ok, no Para ayudar en cualquier forma posible. <risa> no, ahí estamos, entonces. Ok. 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 Good night. Ok, good night, man. See you on Wednesday. Tenemos el día... Miércoles. Miércoles, bro. Miércoles, el día miércoles, sí. Perfecto. Ok, then. Ok. Ok, see you Wednesday, man. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, guys. Hi. I just want to tell you that you should work. You should continue practicing with how many, how much, because these these two topics are very, or these two uh, questions are very, very important. Okay, and we use this question in everyday situations. Okay, we use them every day. So try to practice every day. All right. Thank you for all, and I will see you in the next session. Will be which will be in on Wednesday. Okay, see you guys on Wednesday. Peace.